One, one method of transitive survey is intersection method. Now, in, take note that in, the, in intersection method, you need two transit station or you need two points within your transit is to be set up. Then, uh, and also one distance, which is the baseline between the transit distance or another distance from apart. Uh, we need at least a certain distance. So, and that distance is what we term as the baseline. So we have here a problem about uh, intersection method. And this is, uh, this is solved with the knowledge about inter, uh, about triangulation. So, we have to, this is only, this is, I have already copied of this in your module 3. Okay? So this is the basic that problems so you have to determine the distance and bearing of the two towers C and D an intersection method was used then a line AB 20 meters long was established and the transit was set up at tower C and D and the symbol were taken as follows so maybe uh, the, it is issue tower A and uh, tower C and D. Uh, this is your D, and this is your C. This is your tower C. This is like this like the tower. Maybe we cannot be sure directly this one because uh, na asiroy ka na asiroy dako kayo subak siroy na kana. So this is a river, so they can't give me more mission because of the river. So what will you do is, you establish a certain point apart, uh, which can be measured, measurable. So there is a mission, which is the line AB. So as we see, this is your line AB. Oh, this is your point AB. So this is now your line a B. And that's it. So which is 220 meters. So because in doing the intersection method, we need to transit station. There is atong atong transit station atong base. Tower ta. So gikan sa tower. Uh, gikan sa tower C. Yan gikuan o asimut. So mone atong tower C. We will establish some more meridian. So, ito yung saitan ang D na yun. Saitan ito ang D, paano dito? So, you will have Pana, saitan. So, muna yung asimut. Kini, yung yung asimut. Which is equivalent to 208. Dahil yun, pag awang yung saitan yun yung A. So, yung 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 so that the telescope will sight at A. So it turns to A. So one of the things you can see is the line of sight. One of the line of sight. So one of the things you can see is the line of sight. Which is 258. Then you turn again, going to D. So, natin siya ay kiniyang-iyang asimot, which is equivalent to 300. That's the asimot taken from C going to the three points. Then, Isang po ka instrument, hindi rin ka-mission, o hindi rin ka-sit up. Then, this is our meridian. So, the azimuth from D to A is 300. So, from D to A, pag mo na itong line of sight. So, mo na itong buwan. So, 
Bani Sawor, Asimo Kisi Skuneto, 300. Kini dahi tuhan ni kitinay na din yun. So, ni tuhan ni kitinay sa tuwi tuwi niya. Ito rin talapit. So, tuhan ni kitinay din na rin na. So, na siya kitinay. Then, our DA, oh no, excuse. This is DB. DB is 2014, parang to. So, ikan diri, palo ka na. 314. Then, wow na to ang mga interior angles tayo. Ang interior angles in between the lines. So, we will have In the ring is 40 degrees, so it is 14 minus 300. The kini is this one is 74 degrees. It is 360 minus 14 plus the kini, no? Plus the answer which is equivalent to the bearing. Bearing is what? Kini kini. Plus, then you will have seventy-four as well. And this one, this one is equivalent to forty-nine degrees and thirty minutes, which is equivalent to this. This one is azimuth minus the. Azimuth to base. Azimuth. Azimuth, no? Azimuth. Then, you will have Kinesia. Kiling Azimuth. Minus Aling Azimuth. Then, you will have this. Interior angle na. 31 degrees. So, muna yan ito mga triangles. Then, then, Looking at the triangles, then I can propose triangle. Pana, will be. Pana. Ito ang figure. Pana. So this is your AB. This is your CD. This is your 220 meters. Then this is your thirty-one degrees. This is your forty-nine degrees and thirty minutes. And this one is seventy-four. And this is is fourteen. And then what? Now you can go triangulation. That's your triangulation. So, because the established distance AB is far from the given angle, no opposite sa given angle, we can, we will try first to determine what are the angles, kini yung mga angle dali, kini yung mga angle at ikwaon, in order that we can solve the the distance CD. We can solve the distance CD. We can determine this angle dali. So, we'll first neglect this one. We'll first neglect the established one. Ito sa angle, sa pagkuha sa angle, no? To determine the angle here, we'll first neglect that one. Then we will assume a distance at the at the measurement nearer or adjacent adjacent to the given angle. So, we need to say, dili ka mag-assume kung kuhan angle. So, ato sa nang ineglect, nang ineglect na ito ng distance ng 220. So, we can assume, yeah, we can assume the distance in order to determine the angles here. So, go on. Well, so that you can have, not only an angle, but you can have a ratio proportion. So, we'll solve AB in terms of our assumption. So, shall we say, I assume in the... Assume CD is equal to 10. 
Numeración CD equals to 10. So, we need to say this is your okay. Then we want to solve AB. No? From base from all our assumptions, uh, 10. So, if we want to solve AB, so magwat ng triangle, we will try to extract triangle from A. Uh, wherein AB is present, so you will have uh, this triangle. You can have this triangle. No? And a triangle. This is your A, this is your B, this is your D. Okay? So by, based on this triangle, you will have here an angle of 14 degrees. What I like given. What I like given. So we will make another triangle, so but we can solve the these two sides adjacent to the given to the given angle. So as a tamago triangle, so kidding a triangle to makuha. This is triangle. Kidding a triangle, no? So it's a triangle. Uh, uh, so I say this is figure one. So our figure two is the triangle C D A. No. C D A so that we can solve D A. No. E D A. Kini nga D A. Let's solve that one. So based from this triangle, so you have this one is forty nine degrees. And 30 minutes. Okay, so this is our given 10. So we want to solve DA. Initial to solve DA. So to solve DA, we will use sign law. But to solve, to solve before we can use sign law, we will know first what is this angle. So this angle is just close to 180, the total interior angle of a triangle, minus this one, minus that one. Then you can have. You have the answer of uh, angle A. Well, angle A is just plus to uh, 42 degrees and 30 minutes, no? So it is uh, 180 minus this one, this one good. That's right. So you can have now, you can now start your sine law. You can now start your sine law in order to solve the distance DA. So by sine law, you will have the distance DA, the distance DA, the opposite angle of DA is this one. So, uh, is to sine of 49 degrees and 30 minutes as to our assumption 10 is to, ang yung opposite ani is this angle. So, you have sine 42 degrees and 30 minutes. Then you will have your answer DA equal to 11.26. So you will have 11.26 our DA. So now the answer there. No, this is now 11.26. Kini na po ato DB. So the DB. You can extract this triangle. Oh no. Uh, if this is your DB, then oh, this is your DB. So this one is DB. So we can extract this triangle. Okay, we can use the our assumption 10. So we can triangle to extract. So we can have this triangle. This is D. This is C. This is B. And this is your 10. So you have here 74 degrees. Kinesia is the sum of these two angles. So it is 50, uh, 80. 80 degrees and 30 minutes. So this angle this is the opposite of the given or of the assumed side is equivalent to 180 minus this 
to angles here. So it is equivalent to 25 degrees. Kini siya is 25 degrees and 30 minutes kini angle. Okay. By sine law. Again, by sine law. We, saw, we want to solve dB. So kini siya na kuha dB. So solving for dB, you will have uh, dB, line dB, is to sign of 80 degrees and 30 minutes as to your assumption na 10 meter 10 then yung opposite ani nga side is gini so you have sign 25 degrees and 30 minutes then you have the value of dv no you have the value of dv which is equivalent to 22.91 So, now I'm going to value that 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 22.91 So, from that figure 1 We can now solve AB So, solving for AB We will have From figure 1 We can solve AB by cosine law. No? Cosine law. So you have AB. You want to solve AB. So you just make it AB squared. Is equal to the two sides. The sum of the square of the two sides. Uh, adjacent to the given angle. So you have 11.26 squared. Plus 22.96 22.91 squared minus twice of the cosine of that angle adjusting to the given sides or opposite to your unknown no? so times cosine of 14 degrees times the times the length of the two sides so you will have 11.26 times 22.91 then you will have your AB which is equivalent to your AB is 12.29 12.29 meters so Kinesia uh, is also proportionate with your katong AB na to kakuan na uh, giving uh, AB Okay, but what about the because we are using the same interior angle, so we need to say initial as length current is proportionate with this length. So because we are, yeah, we are this is proportionate with each other, then we can do ratio and proportion. So you will have because we want the value of BC, no? So you have line BC is to hmm, line BC is to 220 meters as to line dc this is this is sa atong katong kari we assume this one as 10 sa other triangulation we assume this one as 10 so you have 10 ang yung value nila sa yung ab is uh, 12.29 so you have your dc is equal to okay so the other, the other unknown or the other requirement there is to determine our bearing AB. So before we can get the bearing AB, we must know first what is our what is our, our interior angle here of this triangle DAB because this is the bearing of your AB. Yes, yeah. Or say there is a tone AB. So if we can determine this angle here, then uh, we'll just deduct everything there. So in order to get the AB. So we know that uh, we know that the bearing B A Bearing the A, no? 
Isip ko ba lang ito? Wait. So, we'll be first this angle. This one. At angle. From this triangle. From figure 1. So, from figure 1 again, we will get angle 8. So, we have this value here. We have the value of AB so we can get the angle 8. So, we can have uh, we can have the sine law. So, sine angle DAB DAB We need to say this angle is to yung at bang we have the 22.91 as to sign of your angle 14 then the equivalent of the angle AB angle AB oh line AB line AB is 12.29 then you will have your angle D A B which is equivalent to angle D A B equivalent to D A B 12 D D oh no D I think what eh angle D B A so in this case, we take up the equality is angle D B A. At the B A karon is kini angle ating kuha. Which is equivalent to ang yellow equality is 11. 11 ang yellow equality is 11.26 ang yung opposite aning angle. Then D, B, A Then you will have an answer of uh, 12 degrees and 48 minutes Pero pwede ka punto no? It can also, it can also go directly to like this one Using the speed 2 We have the same one, answer Okay, so to determine the bearing, uh, we solve this angle here, no? So, D, A, B. So, kini, 153. So, if we will add this angle to this bearing, back bearing of line uh, D, A, then minus 180, then we can solve the bearing A, B. So, we must know first what is the back bearing, back bearing of the line D, A. So, kung mauli itong DA karon, this is 360, uh, 360 degrees man nila. Ang iyang asimot sa itong DA is 300. So, meaning, ang iyang bearing ani is 60. Ano ka na siya? 60. So, yung back bearing din po is also 60. Ha? So, if we will add this one, plus kani, so mauli yung ang gumpalugin na. Then, minus na itong 180. Then that's the bearing. So you will have uh, bearing bearing AB is just equal to Venetia, which is 153 degrees 12 minutes. Venetia ga ang gosil bi. Plus da yon sa 60 degrees. Minus da yon sa gikandiri padulong dina. 100. 80. So your result will be 130 degrees. So you have uh, 153 degrees. 60 minus 180. You will have 33 degrees and 12 minutes, and uh, and the uh, direction is south 
Yes, that's the leading of Pilar Ibi. Now, take note, because ako in my solution to your module 3, there's something wrong there. Kini, I'm wrong. No, kaya kato dito is 54 degrees 30 minutes, which is wrong. Say it to siya pag-sawa. Say it to siya pag So, change that one to 60. Instead of 54 degrees and 30 minutes, change that one to 60. Then, you will have this answer. So, sa inyo ko ang naisayot sa inyo. Naisayot sa inyo. Uh, Dihatil ko ng module. Kaya sayot pagka-copy.